Jason, uh, can take us through the first play, what happened with your ankle, and how did that impact you for the rest of the game? Um, I saw the video. I, I saw it after the game that uh, you know, I came down, you know, on my ankle. Uh, and it's tough because it, you know, kind of impacted me the rest of the night. Uh, swelled up and it was just frustrating that I was kind of like a shell of myself. It's tough to move. Uh, Describe just how much your mobility was limited by the ankle and kind of what it took for you mentally to kind of grind through it and still you know, play those minutes and, and do it in a significant way. I mean, I don't want nobody to feel bad for me. Uh, unfortunately, injuries are a part of this game. Uh, you know, and I've been fortunate enough, right, um, up until this point. You know, I've never missed games. I've played 95% of the games since I've been in the league. I've top two in minutes since I've been in the league. Um, it just was, you know, unfortunate fall tonight on the first play of the game and um, some I was trying to battle through uh, throughout the game. Jason, you guys have talked so much about how you need to be a defense first team over the years and this year there's kind of a balance of being offense and defense so when you guys locked into defense earlier in, uh, later in the series you came back and then tonight you guys couldn't get stops and you weren't really healthy enough to run the offense and it kind of fell apart so what do you think needs to change about the way you guys I guess visualize how you emphasize defense to turn into offense? I think you know we're at our best when you know I think those, these last three games um, besides tonight, you know, when we really honed in on the defensive end, you know, uh, we showed how special and good that we can be as a unit. Uh, and, you know, we didn't shoot the ball necessarily well, but, you know, that's part of being in this league, you know. Uh, our offense fluctuates through from night to night, but, you know, defense can always, you know, for the most part, maintain. Um, even when you miss shots, you know, you still got to lock in on the defensive end. And, you know, um, you know even tonight, they had 50 points at halftime. You know, obviously the game got away at the end. Uh, but, you know, defense is obviously extremely important. Jason, you've, you guys, you've had a lot of success with this group in the last few years. Um, this year in particular, you guys were you know, considered title favorites coming out of the first round here. Does this m make it sting a little bit more knowing you know, the golden opportunity you guys had here after coming so close last season? Yeah, it's tough. Um, I, I, it's, it's as simple as that. It's tough, right? You made it to the conference finals again and so close to getting back to the finals and giving ourselves another chance. and. Uh, yeah, I mean, as you would expect, it's tough to lose. Along those same lines, you guys have come close now a number of times. What needs to change for you, for the team, for the organization to kind of get over the hump? To win a championship? Yeah. Uh, I mean, we've shown that we can get there. Uh, I mean, shit, we get to the conference finals. It's my fourth time in six years and I've been to the finals. Uh, once, uh, and we, you know we had a special opportunity this year. Uh, we just fell a little bit short. It's not like we're not capable. We don't have the talent. You know we do. Uh, you know it just didn't go our way this year. Then where do you think it went wrong this year um, to kind of let that opportunity go away? Uh, yeah, that's a great question. You know, we didn't play well enough to win this series. Uh, for, you know, majority of it, right? You know, bad third quarter of first game and uh, bad fourth quarter of the second game. You know, they beat us the third game. You know, we didn't play well at all and won three in a row. And then tonight was just tough. So, uh, -uh. We just didn't play well enough to win this series. Dan, last question on the right. 
Jason, how would you, with that said, uh, how would you look at Joe, who had a you know, tough start, obviously, thrown into that position as the interim, and then you guys grew as a team. How would you look at what Joe was able to do with you guys all season and, and as you went along, grow with him? I mean, it was his first year. We got to the conference finals game seven. Uh, I don't think people give him us enough credit that two days before the season start, you know, find out we don't have a new coach. Uh, we didn't have Rob the first 25, 30 games of the season. Uh, we never got a chance to have Gallo, and we got a new coach <laughs> one day before media day. Uh, you know, that was an adjustment, and we, uh, we all figured it out. Uh, obviously, we went to win the championship. It didn't happen, but, you know, I think Joe did a great job. And we won 50-some-odd games. We got to game seven, conference finals. Uh, and obviously, everybody can be better, learn from this. Uh, but, you know, I think Joe did a great job this year.